Hi, you amazing humans, and welcome to my ad series. I'm so excited to share this next one with you. Um, it is a hollow hold with a leg flutter and a stacked weights to overhead. So um, I can't wait. Grab your weights, grab your positive attitude, and I will see you on the mat. Next one I'm so excited to show you um, is a hollow hold with a shoulder stack um, with leg flutters. So the leg flutters, we're gonna try to flutter them for about a 10 count, um, keeping that lower back engaged. Uh, and this again, we are gonna go with that 10 reps, three sets. Um, so you're just going to follow along here and I'm gonna explain as I demo to you um, how we are going to use this in the best way possible to kick that core into gear for you. So um, what we're gonna do again, we're gonna set ourselves up on the mat, okay? We're gonna stack our shoulders. So pick your weight accordingly. Um, this is my nice little eight pound weight. Um, and we wanna directly stack that over the shoulder. Okay, and then we are going to lift up into that hollow body position. Okay, and leg flutters here for five, four, three, two, and one. You're gonna keep cycling that for 10 count so that we hit that lower ab and lower core really hard in this hollow body position, keeping that lower back engaged in the floor. And um, what I want you to think about as you are doing this is flutter your legs for 10 or scissor your legs for 10, come down, rest back up into your hollow hold again. So repeating this um, cycle of movements for 10 reps um, and three sets of that. So, or two sets to start, because this hollow body position is definitely an advanced movement um, that we wanna make sure that we're not straining the neck. Um, and if you feel like you are straining the neck, you don't have to do it with the weights. You can do it like this as well. So I'm just gonna give you another option here. Well, I've got your attention um, to do a hollow hold leg flutter this way so that the neck is definitely supported. The core is still being worked in the legs. Quads are engaged here. Okay, we're gonna keep this nice and tiny and we wanna really think about that lower back engaged in the floor. And, and when you come out of this, really important not just to flop your legs down. I want you to bend your knees and bring them down to the floor gently so that we don't um, torque that lower back. I hope you enjoy this. I uh, hope you add it into your regular ab routine. Um, and remember that you are worth it. You got this. No excuses. Michelle here and I just wanted to thank you so much. Um, and if you do like the content that you are seeing um, in my ad series, I want you to like and subscribe, okay? I am a little bossy, so I like it when you guys listen to me. Not only for your form and your function, but also when I say like it. <laughs> Just hit the goddamn button, okay? Um, so if you want more, you can find me on Instagram under Diva Delight 911 okay? Also, Ignite Fusion Fitness. You can find me on Facebook under Ignite Fusion Fitness. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my You Can Be A Fit Bitch To podcast. You can find that wherever you get your podcasts from, okay? And I want you to know that I love and support you, and I want you to go out there and kick some ass.